All right, before we get into this video, I just want to show you some quick footage of the Fish Bites end of summer sale. This won't take too long. Check this out real quick. It's pretty cool. And just go from there. Just taking a picture. Oh, oh yeah, that's, that's just the two I've gotten so far. I'm getting ready to start on the third one. Fishing shallow water, I do. I want floats. Nope, because if I if if I'm fishing shallow water, my floats not doing anything, but just moving around. Well, if it's moving like this, is a fish got a chance? He's probably tried to catch it three or four times. You never caught anything. Okay. Guys, what's going on? We got Dustin here. Dustin, Cullen. We got Barry and Cullen, man, representing the fish bites up there. What are you guys catching? Anything? Oh, uh, we got it. Dustin got a red this morning. We uh, lost two tarpon. They didn't take the hook. They bit the bait. God, well, everybody's getting skunked out here today. <laughs> red wash repeat. Man. Well, it's it's one of those days. It's the end of the summer. At least we yeah. have the mullet run. Yeah, yeah. It's going to start picking up here for sure. Mullet runs uh, coming. The pompano are starting to show up. It's about to get some fun. Yeah. There we go. Keep fishing. Oh, wow. Oh, oh. Oh, time out. Where'd you just get that thing hold from? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Just, okay, just you gotta give your dad I'm his fish. Him okay, fish. No, no. Give your dad his fish. Give him his credit. <laughs> just keep reds and coolers. Come on. Dustin, take your credit. Yep. Take your credit. State Tom. regulations now have changed. We can only keep one per person, so there's your one. That's why we only caught one. Yeah, yeah. yeah. He only <laughs> caught one. That's it. He said, I quit. Now we're gonna catch some uh, tarpon. <laughs> Very cool. Good morning guys, it's 6 a.m. Welcome back to the channel. St. Augustine Sandman here. We're headed to Volano Beach. We're gonna fish right next to the jetties. Uh, if you don't know what jetties are, this was long rocks, man-made rocks that they put out there. <laughs> Not man-made rocks, but they, uh, they structured them man-made. Anyway, we're gonna be uh, targeting whatever will bite. I'm going for redfish. I'm going for maybe pompano, whiting. I will take home a stingray and catch and cook a stingray. I will catch and cook a stingray today uh, or any bonnet head sharks because they're edible. This is the first week of September and it might be a little early for the mullet run, but I'm going to see what's, what's happening in the surf if there's any mullet. This is kind of cool. A Magic Beach Hotel right here. This Magic Beach Hotel is going to be in uh, this new Netflix series coming up. They've been filming here in Volano all week. That's cool. A little sightseeing. The sun's just starting to come up. I just rolled up on the spot and there's people here before the sun has even totally come up yet. You've got to be early. That is it, you just got to. Well, we got just the amount we need. We got about five on that cast. That's good enough for me. All right, we're getting this live mullet out here. It's gonna be tough all these people here we'll try to do our best to get around them <laughs> are you out far uh, um, right where there's some tarpon rolling over these oh the bait just exploded on exploded on the surface There, there we go. Oh yeah, blowing up. If I was limber, I'd be walking across these rocks right here to the end and tossing out. Oh yeah, there's tarpon tails completely flapping out. They're rolling over there towards the end of the jetties. I don't know who these guys are, but I'm, comp I'm competing with them for uh, throwing these live mullet in here. It's very tight. These tarpon are just 
destroying these mullet. There's a huge, this must be the mullet run. I mean, holy cow, there, there's thousands of mullet right here. We're trying. I mean, th there's thousands of mullet for it to choose from. It's deciding to go for those, my bait, or everyone else's bait that's out there also, so. I am pairing this with my Pen Slammer 3. I got a 30 pound braid with some steel leader attached to the end. The three aught circle, um, the three aught tail hook, sorry. Three ounce, three ounce pyramid weight. to see right here hey yeah yeah it, it's pretty busy it's pretty busy yeah. but uh you might be able to squeeze in like right here i know uh -huh. blowing up oh, there's tarpon like rolling hard on all these baits it was awesome oh this guy's line just went completely slack oh he told me to watch his line and his line went completely slack He doesn't even have a weight on there. I don't know what to tell the guy. So I haven't, uh, we do haven't you caught use anything it with, uh, today. Heads on? Uh, no, I take the heads, heads off. Heads off? Do you half them or you use a whole shrimp? I I do like a third of the shrimp. Yeah, I mean I don't even use. Okay. Your hooks are like, look how small your hooks are. You want to yeah. just have it enough for the size of the hook, and then tip it with a little piece of fish bite to keep it on. And then if something takes your shrimp, you still got bait on. Well, you know, but they'll come off. There's nothing wrong with having more scent. More than you need. <laughs> nothing wrong with it. So we're, is that the squid flavor? They, no, they actually don't have a squid flavor. Oh, I thought it was or maybe they do, but I've never seen it. It might be somewhere else. But this is shrimp. Okay, shrimp is sand, please. Shrimp. Were you sand, please? I yeah. think last time. Well, you got shrimp going on, so I'm, I'm matching the hatch with the scent. If I was a fish, I'd go after that. Look yeah. at that. Look at, Look at this. Know. This is this is nice. All the bait's jumping as he's reeling in, so that's cool. He just cast that out. He cast it out right. Oh, that's the tarpon rolling. Wow. Let's go. Oh, a jack. It's a jack. Hell yeah. Oh, that's scaring all the, that's what's scaring all the bait out there. I saw a tarpon tail too. It's like, hey. Hey. Hell man. What you, oh, you they got a whiting. They throw their nets and I'm just like catching them like this. All right. First, Look at that baby. first fish of the day. Kathy catches it. That's, yeah. that's a bait, that's a bait whiting. Bait size white. All right, I think I have my first fish on. Is on the live mullet. And I think I have another fish on too. Okay, we got ourselves our stingray. We got our stingray. In the eye. In the eye. In the eye. Oh my god. All right. Keep it and eat it, and we're gonna make sting nuggets. You keep stingrays? I might today. All right. Where's? Let me see. Sting nuggets. Sting, Where are we? Sting how are we hooked up? Holy mess, huh? It is a mess. All right. Yeah, we won't stand up. Trying to get, trying to get this leader for you. Let's get that out of the equation. 
Just cut it off, Kathy. Yeah. Really? You don't want to save it? You got something. What'd there you get? We go. Look at here. Oh, you got a spade fish. I did. Oh, back yeah. it up, back it up, back it up. Wow. You got a spade fish. Very cool. Nice little spadey. There you go. Can I touch him? You want to touch him? Be careful of the hook. Just the bottom. Wow, huh, buddy? Spade fish. Those are actually really good eating. We've never caught one of those. Yeah. Ready, kid? I saw some tiny ones on the There we go. Okay. Hey. Wrong way. Yeah. Oh. 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 Are you okay? I lost my grip. Got him now. Yeah. Wow. I'm gonna go bait it. Guys, it's slimy tail. What kind is that? White tip. What is that? It looks like a, a spinner. Spinner? Yeah. Two back there. Is that a catch and release? That's a female. Is she pregnant? Is that a uh, I don't think spinner? she's. She, I think. I, I think so. Spinner, but I, it might be a sharp nose. Sharp. Yeah, it looks like a spinner. It might be a spinner. Yeah. yeah. Spinners and the black tips look almost yeah, identical. Same. Yeah, you're right. Yeah. Now this guy uh, who's releasing the shark here, he's actually a good Samaritan man. He came out of nowhere. The guy who actually caught the fish, or the shark was just letting it stay out of the water. It was dying. We were, we were like, we took over and said, no, buddy. And then this guy came in. He's like, here, I'll, I'll go revive it. I'll revive it. And it, we thought it was a goner, but then he, it started coming back to life. Thank God. Started it's, a, it's a spinner shark. Good job on the revive. God. I thought it was. He was I did too, man. I was, I was like, damn, get him back in the water or he yeah. can do something with him. Yeah, hey, I don't think he knows what he's doing. He said, good eat, good eat. I said, nah, let's go. Uh, good revive, man. I, I was worried. Uh, Thank you, dear. Uh huh. That's my it's the 53rd birthday. That's my good deed for the day. Good job. Hey, hey, good job my birthday's tomorrow. Hey, happy birthday, man. Happy birthday, man. That's good, man. Nice revive. Wow, he revived hey, it. That feels good. Yeah. That feels good. Yeah. When he was rolling over, I thought, I know, oh, man. I know, they oh. kept him out. Yeah, he's all down a while. I'm glad you did that. Yeah, good luck you got today. Thanks. Gonna need it. It was very Ooh. tough fishing this Labor, Labor Day. Labor Day weekend, man. It was amateur hour for sure, at its finest. Well, we didn't catch any fish, did we, Dean? Nope, but we got, we did catch a stingray. And uh, we did see some cool stuff. The one guy to my left was just completely casting over my lines like a hundred thousand times. So we decided to pack it up and say, hey, we're going somewhere else. All right. I try to get videos out to you guys like twice a week or once a week. That's what I want to do. The fishing has been extremely difficult and challenging the end of the summer. The water is still pretty warm. Uh, luckily, we do have the mullet run coming through. Uh, I wanted to show you some footage of fish that I did catch this week. I have been fishing, but nothing I thought was substantial enough for a video, but we did catch some fish. And uh, here's some shots of those fish. I don't think it's big enough. Seven, maybe? Nine. Just so barely. close, brother, so close. Probably Jack. It's probably Jack Craval the way it's running. Yeah, you just gotta get it away from the duck. Yeah, it is. Calm down. Uh, that's perfect though, like right in the corner of the mouth. See you later, Jack. <laughs> My umbrella just like, I had an umbrella just launched out of here. Uh, he's helping me out. 
Where is he at? There. He got it. Thank you. Thanks, dude. You're the man. Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you. Hey, you catch anything? Nothing. Got one hit, and that's it. I did get it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Guys, this channel is designed specifically for your entertainment purposes only. If you learn something cool, St. Augustine Sandman channel. Make sure you're a subscriber if you're not already subscribed. Thank you guys so much for watching. It means a lot to us. It doesn't cost you anything to subscribe. And we'll keep, keep watching the videos, man. We do appreciate it. Uh, come along with us. Hit me up if you ever need anything, if you have any questions or anything. I'm always going to answer as best as I can in a timely manner uh, to any of your comments or anything like that. So thank you guys so much, and uh, keep it reeling. We'll see you on the next video. With me, say, say.